So now we know how or what business processes we're going to cover. We're going to make sure that continuity is not interrupted. At that point, the BCP team establishes the specific procedures to protect provisions and processes. Number one, people. Highest priority, no exceptions. If you do not ensure the safety and well-being of the people involved in your organization, no other plans matter at all. People are always the highest priority. I recently talked to a friend of mine who works with the federal government and was sharing with me a particular plan which was to be put into place when there was a chemical spill. Whenever there was a hazardous material spill, the policy stated that the employee should stay in the area until contact was made with the hazmat team and hazmat was dispatched. Well, the problem with that is that if somebody has spilled a hazardous material next to your desk, you don't want to stick around. So they had to reword it a little bit and change it so that the personnel could leave the area and then as soon as they were at a safe area, then call in the hazmat teams. So the people are always going to be your number one priority protect and provide for their immediate needs. And another thing that you'll gain out of doing it this way, not only will you retain the respect of your employees, but you'll also encourage them to know that the company or the organization puts them first, and they're going to want to help more and more with continuing the organization.